Greetings, traveler. Right, so. But other than that, I really enjoyed the post. Appreciate the uh, the mention there on the shaman thing. We had this before. We didn't yeah. keep the veteran. Would you keep Yeti or Harden Mole for the long? Um, I think I would probably Harden Mole in this matchup because we really don't want to fall. Yeah, I think behind. so too. I think we Harden Mole for the three. Okay, I can live with that. Yeah. TLDR Shady invented Shamanate Arena. <laughs> yep. Just like Raynath created Hearthstone. I'm so mad because like I watched your stream enough that like I finally something finally clicked with Shaman like a week or so ago and now I'm like, damn it, now it's gonna end. Finally yeah, right. <laughs> well, I mean I, I, I understood it, but like I just I'm not as it, it's not as natural of a play style for me. So it's it it's just hard, but I, I, I really like it now. Yeah, it's it's different. I think that's why, right? It's just fun. It's different. You need to really go like, yeah. well, not doing something feels really bad, but I have these two crushing hands in the volcano, so I guess I, nothing can go wrong. <laughs> and that's kind of how you should approach it. Like, yeah, I mean, you're going to be fine. So if we dagger and hit it, he can hit ping. And then we hit it back. But then we don't get the death speaker. If we lasher, he trades. He doesn't need to ping, but I guess he will still ping. Hmm. I think I'd still play. I think I'd play Lasher here, but it's really close. Yeah. I think I would play it. Yeah, just push one phase. You're looking um, forward to Wild Arena, Shady. I mean, I the way I usually approach it, Sim, is that I I just really enjoy whatever meta we're in because I I just dig in and really like so. Yes, it will change things up, but it'll be um it'll be fine. It'll be uh, I I think by the end of the event. I'll probably be sad that it goes away. Like this could be a very <laughs> dangerous prediction, but I always gotta I, roll. I always gotta roll into things and really like figure them out. Start of my metas are always a little rough. I always love the. Uh, I lo what I'm really looking forward to is having to. We just dead speaker about... kill a two one right. So yeah, yeah. Like, Sorry. Yeah, no, yeah. no, no. Go um, ahead. Go ahead. I was gonna say I'm. I'm really looking forward to uh, thinking about all the cards to play around, like light bomb and stuff. You know, like all the weird cards that. You're not going to really be able to play around with all the board clears because there's going to be so many of them, but it's going to be interesting for sure. Yeah. It's like, I think one of the biggest things is that it will also drive more oh. traffic to Arena, which is really fun. So. Okay, that makes sense now. I was like, what's he doing? What are you doing, son? So we could leave him with a 3 3 or a 2 3, but we'd get to keep a 1 1. Hmm. Got a Strider, right? Yes, Strider happens for sure. Instinctively, I want to kill the 3 3. I do too. Okay, let's do it. Yeah. I hope they accidentally remove Priest during the Wild Swap. <laughs> no one knows if Shady will have fun in Wild Arena. We can only assume. Now they'll have Talon, Talon, Priest, and a Dark Speaker. They'll have both. Not Dark Speaker, is that what it's called? Yeah, no, um, Dark Cultist. Yeah, that's it. Coin Dark Cultist and then that Talon Speed, uh, you know what I mean? Yeah, that's pretty yeah. sick. Instinctively, it's kill the 2 3 play Bone Baron. We did just hit the Void Ripper, but we can't Dagger and Razor Petal to kill yeah, the 3 2. So exactly. I guess kill the 2 3 and Bone Baron makes sense. Yeah. Will you be, uh, will you be playing Sim? I think I asked you in your stream, but I, I'm not sure if I got a reply at some point. Busy stream, I get it. Pay attention, class. Hmm. I think it's safe to say we kill the teacher, right? Yes. It's either it Razor like, Petal the 1-1 one, one, and Sludge or right. Jam the Unraveler, right? I think I like the Sludge a little better than playing the Unraveler next turn. Yeah, same here. I think we don't give him the 1 in the ping. Tyber was talking about unique set rotations. I've, th I've actually always said that would be cool too, but I don't know if they'll ever do that. Yeah. 
I'm not sure if I like that though. Like, I don't it's... love it. I mean, I, honestly, the, what they're doing now is like they're at least they're starting. A, you know, there's the card release, and then they're doing. I like the idea of a of event a couple months into the you know meta to like change it because like the you know the meta change is fun. Like, I'll have fun for a while. One for the cards coming back, and two for just like seeing like what people are playing and like that's always fun oh, hello hello uh, no <laughs> we, we can't do everything i know i know no. i know oh we oh you're saying like voider for nsi yeah yeah right i want to like make <laughs> sure yeah mm. i mean oh, is it, it is it correct then mm. Because you could also just trade, because like the two damage on the two two is gonna kill it anyway. Hmm. What I'm saying is you could trade and then go like loan and SI, and then you'd get right the taunt and divine shield. Hmm. It's not terrible. Yeah, you don't get five face, but clear. You could also get the unraveler and the skelly down. I actually think trading the six two is better, so I think we start with that. I guess lone SI is guy and play a Skelly in the middle is fine. Yeah. yeah. I don't need any of you. No. This play feels weak, but in all honesty, we're so far away from like yeah. pressuring him anyway. It, this is probably better. Okay. When will the quest pack draws will be happen? You get an email within the next week. Well, maybe he won't don't get greedy. No portal it. Damn it. Oh. Yeah, fucking portal is always nice. Yes. Hey, should we draw for another spider? <laughs> <laughs> we have a very nice flip right now, right? Yeah, we do. So I guess I would flip and then draw because I don't think I want a 4 2. Oh, that's right. It is. Sorry. I was thinking we need dagger. We don't. You're right. Yeah, this is yeah. fine. Um, I guess I'll put this here. Yeah. Out of the loop, what's the quest draw? Uh, we had an event uh, until yesterday. Um, part of this fine for me. Or oh, sorry. Uh, I think it's good. Yeah. I'd hold on to the one one, I think. Yeah. Cool. We had an event where every daily quest you completed gave you a raffle ticket into something where there will be giving away 3,000 packs to one person. A Lich King Helm to another, and then it's like a bunch of smaller card packs to other people. Wow, this went a lot better than expected. I thought it was gonna AOE us. Yeah, it's it's unfortunate that it actually hit that, but yeah. other than that, it was not too bad. Um, Seems like a good moment to get the Unraveler down. Yeah, I'm just trying to think where, yeah, how we're trading. I feel like it's just dagger and three into the four and two four into the two one. Yeah, yeah, that seems fine. Yeah. yeah. Probably uh, hanging on to the skelly, seeing as his ping doesn't do anything yet. Oh, you get Lich King Helm as well if you win the grand prize? Okay. Sorry, I thought someone would just get the helm, but I guess that would feel kind of <laughs> sucky. Oh, you get his helmet? That's hilarious. Yeah, you get like the. I didn't even. Oh, come on. Ah! Oh. Okay. Well, at least he got a but still, card. but still. I know it is. It's really yeah. hey, nice. Yeah, I think we play four two two and then just go three phase, because he has to ping the shield on top of the volatile. So. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You said four. That's why I was. Like, what? Okay. Oh yeah. Sorry. It's okay. Uh, my volatile. Brain, my brain just saying the saying stuff. I think the dragon goes between the 1-1 one, one and the 2-2, two, two, right? Yeah, yeah. That's what I was thinking about. Alright. Yep, face face. To be fair, the helm should be worth a lot of money. Yeah, that's right, just collectors. Yeah. Do we need to sign up somewhere, or is it automatic? Well, you didn't... Like, it's it's over now, the contest. As long as you complete the daily quests, you... You, uh... You entered. Ooh. Skeleton's good now. <laughs> That's also good. Yeah. This is really weird. 
Uh, yeah, Skelly. Skelly is fine. Definitely. Hmm. How do you want to do this? Should we just get rid of the volatile now? And trade it and then, like. Yeah. Despot. So I guess you go face with the fairy, right? See what happens? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I think you just dead speaker to cow and then trade with the. Uh, oh, sorry. No, no. Trade off the volatile and then dead speaker to 2 2. Yep. Yeah, yeah. And then dagger to fish. Interesting. He, or he opted to play a spell related secret over pinging off. Either our shield or our volatile. Yeah, that is. Oh, thank God. It's a really good for us. If I win the 3000 packs, can I open them on your stream? Uh, I don't know. Some people like that, but I think it gets boring very fast. Mm, so, creeper on the right? Yes. Feels like fairy and a 1-1 one, one into the 4-4. Four, four. Yep. I'm just trying to figure out whether we should trade something in here. Darcy I think you're it. fine using the Sunwalker because it's just Blizzard, right? Yeah. Yeah. yeah it's for moments like these, man, where like Elven Minstrel and Sprint. Oof. So good. So good. Or or even more five drops. But we can't complain, we made it all the way up to ten, played against a lot of like aggressive stuff. Okay. Had that for a very long time. It's been holding that since turn four, that secret. Yeah. Two two face. Probably four one face because it gets pinged off. Yeah, that's true. Yep. And then all face. Yeah. Yep. So the secret might be um, him waiting until we played our last Skelly and it's minion related. Yeah. yeah. We've managed our life total pretty well here. Like we're still sacked a lot of one ones and stuff. Yeah. Attempt to sap. Yeah. Shocker. Any of these sap targets are not that bad. Oh, this is perfect, right? Yeah. yeah. Scientist the 2-2. Yep. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I guess I want to put this in there, but... Do you ever put Go it ahead. on the creeper? Because then he literally has no sap targets. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's true. <laughs> I think you do, right? Yeah. <laughs> That's so annoying for him. Yeah. <laughs> I like this. Yeah, it's good. Trust your mind to come back for a while. Okay. But I guess the way how you say it, you won't then. Right. Dunk, dunk, dunk. Let's go. I love that. I love that play. What you gonna give me back, bro? These are like all good. Yeah, he could give me back, or he could give us back the death speaker. Or I could just double the death strike. Mm. Yeah, <laughs> or nothing. Law. Oh. All right, Ravenholt, go. So one face re dagger every time. I think he tempo it. Yeah. Yeah, because like we don't have anything to combo it with anyway. Punished? No, he had ping, so it didn't matter. Ah, okay, Sim. No, that makes sense. That makes sense for sure. Oh. Oh. Okay. What? I'm very happy we played it. Goodbye, Sap. Me too. That mean he has like pyro in hand, and he's like, what is that? It's odd. Uh... <laughs> oh, we have no way to get face though. We have no. Well, the only reach we have is the Ravenholt, really. 
Yeah, so I'm just debating whether we hold the deadly for a turn or not. But what are we holding it for? This, I guess we could combo a kidnapper with it next turn, right? So you'd go scientist and hit him down to six this turn and then next turn. Yeah, I think that's fair. So just scientist and then swing face and re yeah. dagger. And then yeah. we'll poison him the turn after. Yeah. Uh, three turn clock. Yeah, we need to get there. But he needs to kill everything we play. Oh, good draw. Nice. And if I hit the kidnapper, I'd be so rewarded. Ooh. Oh, we hit the kidnapper. Right. Oh, we did. I see. You see things so much more. It's deck tracker. That's why I'm like, it's just deck tracker. Yeah. yeah. Feels good, man. All right, poisons up to four three. Put him to three. Yep. Yep. Ronsu says, "I don't really like this line." Ronsu, man. <laughs> After all these years, have you learned nothing? <laughs> if I make a play that you don't like, I'm I'm about to get lucky, man. <laughs> That's how it works. Uh, nice. Boom. Solid. Oh. We are Shady Diggy Rogue. Shady Diggy Rogue. Also, <laughs> everything? Come on. Yeah. This is honestly the most fun I've had playing Rogue the whole meta. It's probably it's the best kind of rogue spun right now. Yeah, it's probably the best rogue deck I've had, to be honest. Oh. Yeah, and dagger into loans just so so good. Keeps yeah. us safe. I don't mind the pre hit. And the low? Yeah. yeah, yeah, I agree. Yep, that's exactly what I was thinking. <laughs> it's always good to like play the 12th game and look over and see a sea of shady diggies in chat. I love that. It's my favorite. Diggy diggy. To a Void Ripper? <laughs> yeah, right? Oh, uh, actually, no. Not enough, right? Still one off. Damn it. What's one off? The Void Well, he'll get six health, right? So. Oh, oh, right. Yeah, I forgot about that. I, yeah, I'm thinking Kooky. Sometimes when I think of this card, I think of like mm -hmm. Target. One of the few moments where it's actually worse than Kooky. Mm -hmm. So, how are we gonna tackle this? So if we play Basilisk, he'd hit it and then probably hit the shield and play a two. Mm, I think it's dangerous not to hit, not to play Yeti. Yeah, I like the Yeti. Yeah, I think it's Yeti, two face, and then see if we get there next turn. Oh, sorry. Yeah. Uh, do you tend to keep Call to Arms in your opening hand when playing Paladin? It depends on the deck, but it's definitely not a bad keep. No. And if you have coin, it's really good. Yeah, with coin for sure. On the play, it depends a bit how many ones you have. Well, I've been having a lot of success with Paladin drafting around, hopefully getting the call because it, it's so good late game because it thins your deck out if you haven't drawn them all. I haven't seen any of my last six Paladin drafts. I thought they were like removed it <laughs> or like heavily reduced it. Oh yeah, but they I might have because at the beginning yeah. of the meta it was insane. Like it was hard to not get like four of them. Oh, that's yeah. bigger goat. That's bigger baby. Oh, that's harsh. Yeah, that would have been so bad. Volatile Stone Skin kill the 4 4 could be a mm -hmm. thing. Volatile in the middle then. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's 
checking there's nothing we're missing, right? I don't think so. Nope, seems good. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Do we get SI or own volatile and face tank the dragon? Someone in chat rightfully point pointed out, but I'm not sure if that's correct. Because okay. you're still taking six. I don't think it's correct, but it's a really yeah. good it's a really good spot. Yeah. Shit. Yeah. I think you invest a little bit too much resources in doing something this line probably does better. But I didn't see that. That was good. So it's good to like this it's the same thing as with the foul, right? You might spot like a really good the foul execution wise and like but from a macro point of view it makes no sense to the foul. It's kinda of the same thing here. From a macro point of view, like looking at the next turns and the damage we take. It makes not that much sense to go for a uh, for a Q play here. Yeah, if we get to poison our uh, volatile, we get to have some fun. It's true. The giddigiol. I'm a dwarf and I'm the game. Oh, okay. Always oh. lucky. Wow. Always lucky, oh, boys. Man. It's a bit overkill almost, right? What, the Death Speaker? Yeah, because you could Death Speaker SI. I, I guess it's just Lone Champion and then either SI or Death Speaker. Just which one yeah, would like value the, more? I think with the orb that we have right now, I think I'm okay with just doing Death Speaker because it, it basically slows him down next turn. Because... Yeah, but I mean, we're always going to slow him down, right? It's just whether we want to SI a 1-1 one, one, or whether we want to use that right. speaker on. Because face, know, face always kills right. a 1-1, one, one, right? We can do yeah. that. And we always play lone champion because we don't want to waste any effects. Yeah. I think that speaker is correct because he will spread now and SI will be nice. So. Yes, immune protects the shield. Take no damage, lose no shield. You like SI more, you value the Basilisk. Oh, I mean, we're, we're always protecting Basilisk. It's just what resource we're using. Right. Okay. If you can't kill it, it's pretty decent. Go ahead. Mrs. Taunt and Divine Shield, yeah. Look at that, that's like we're like copying. Poison. That's hilarious. Counter him. Uh, wow, do you ever just go for the flip here and put eight in his face and say, what you got, buddy? I don't hate it. Like, yeah, it's like, if he has Corrupted Seer, if that is the answer to what he has, then we're sad, but... Yeah. Specifically Corrupted Seer. I killed 4-4 four, four, flip, go face and play the Forest Rider. Yeah, it's just positioning-wise... I guess it's... Um, uh, Strider in the middle, yeah, so 1-1 one, one goes in, yep. Strider in the middle, and then where does this thing go? Also in the middle, right? Somewhere? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah, you're not gonna get that extra immunity to Ant Mist. he's just going to dagger it anyway. No! We can't outvalue this, guys. I think this play, I really like this line. I think it's the right line. Turning on the smart machine. Hmm. That's a good play, smart. Me like that line. Me here, face. Me like that line. It's okay. We'll, we'll draw three spiders next turn. We have the space off. I'll take two. Kaladar's a little green. Two is, two is enough. Three. I have to shoot high so that I. That's how I, it works for me. I have to shoot above. 14 damage right now. Ah, oh, we only got one. Never lucky, chat. We're not trading, I don't think, at all, are we? The instinct is to play the scientists and then just SI dagger the basilisk and push face with the others. Yeah. 
I like a it. cheap way to remove something that would remove a minion from you. Yeah. yeah. Let's go, boys! Let's go! Doesn't matter where I put this SI. Really? Well, no, really Probably between the 4 2 and the 4 4. It's that's that's what I was looking at. Okay. Yeah. Yep. I agree. At this point, it actually did make a difference. So this is kind of the thing you do when you're being aggressive, guys. Like, you still want to push damage, of course, but you also don't want to give them too much of a board to work with. So we don't lose any minions by trading here. We just lose the effect of the uh, poison and the SI. We take away his weapon abilities most of the way, unless he has Violet Illusionist mm -hmm. or something. Okay, it's a good sign. I was holding my breath there for Primordial. That's pretty much the only thing that's gotten out of this. So. <laughs> Oh, was that Mimic Claw? No, that wasn't Mimic Claw. Yeah, they didn't cut. I hope not. Biggest minion always goes face first in this situation. Um, not always, right? Because it could be well, a betrayal. If it's yeah. a betrayal. Which it probably, it honestly is more likely to be a betrayal. It's drafted a little more often. An 11 win rogue would be weird if he had evasion, yeah. Um, 2 3 would. Mean that we could still get six face. You could put the creeper between the scientist and the three three, and then go face with the three three if you want. Let's see. Would you still get lethal? No. You'd have to go face with the two three, right? Yeah. If you go face with the two three, you have lethal, right? If it's not evasion. Mm -hmm. But it'd be better to put creeper on either edge, right? So it tanks the damage. Like, but either side of the two three. Okay, sure. Okay. It doesn't matter, because if it's like... It's betrayal, you kill him. Okay. Oh, Swash Burglar, sure. And dwarf. I mean, with this scale bane draw, we should just clean it out, right? Um, yeah. Sack one, scale bane takes its place, dagger the one one. Yeah. Okay. yeah. Missed one. I prefer to get lethal. Dig, dig, hole, digging hole. Drafted that. Okay, we're having a game, guys. I guess we should have uh, not sacked the SI. Oh. That's, I didn't see that coming. So don't worry about it. It feels like we flip, then mold, and scalebane mold in the center. Yeah. Probably scalebane in the uh, no mold in the center is fine because even if the mold gets buffed, it's fine. Yep. Burps would have had lethal. Yeah, he swash burglar the evasion. Trying to get those spiders. Oh, oh, he's dead. Nice. Nice. Got him, boys. Well Yesterday, 12 0 drew it. Not 12 and 2 rogue. Tempo. Faces back on the menu. Faces back on the menu. Love it. Faces back uh, on the menu, boys. Alright. Let's see what that. What our efforts. You look. Yeah. Yeah, that guy had a really good deck to be priest. Mimic pods and sprints. I can definitely see how he got his wins. Alright, can you see? We can see. Alright, cool. Is face part of the keto diet? I guess so, right? Should be low in, low in carbohydrates. <laughs> <laughs> uh. Hmm. 